Hey YouTuber, it's Allie coming to you with the really fun 4th of July look. Of course, it's my American red, white, and blue. If you want to see how to do this really fun, patriotic American look, keep on watching. Okay, so after you've applied the primer for your eyeshadow, go ahead and put a creamy eyeshadow, something light like Milk from NYX. Put that all over your eyelid and including your tear duct and a little bit underneath here. So we're going to put some color down there too, like that, okay? Now these colors, I'm going to foil them, so I'm going to wet them. Grab a flat eyeshadow brush like this, and I'm grabbing this red color. This is kind of the best that I can come up with. It's um, It kind of reminds me of Cranberry from MAC. Putting it on like the first half, I would say the first quarter of the lid. And also put some of that inside the tear duct in here. Just a tiny bit. Don't go out t outside of the lid too much. Now we are going to put some white and then I'm putting that white right next to this to the red. It's right there. Don't worry about doing the stripes because once you lay down that blue then it'll be easier just to do the stripes than to do it now. A, a blue, a frosty sea blue. What I'm basically doing is going from, you can use a thinner brush if you want. I will use a thinner brush in a little bit, but right now it doesn't really matter. I'm just having fun with this. So, so it's from the outside, you bring a line in, and then you just basically fill it in. And you make it like a little bit, you know, like a, like if you were doing eyeliner, kind of like that. You just fill it in with an arch. So I foiled it, and now you're going to see the color more intense. All right, so like this. All right, so I got a, like a slanted um, brush. And I'm just making it a little more precise. And it's foiled, so it's going to come on heavy. Trying to make it a little pointy right there. And basically just bring it down. Now grab the same brush you used for the white. This is a pencil brush. That's what I used for the white. And I'm grabbing more of the white and fill that in to make it look curved like that. So it kind of goes up and then winged out, okay? Like this. And then you're going out. So grab the red and you're building like an arch. So you're coming in from here. You can blend and all that stuff later. You just kind of blend the two colors together. Whatever two colors are adjacent to each other, you basically just smudge the line where they meet and that's the extent of your blending. And then you're just going out to meet the end of the eyebrow like that. So basically right there, remember you have white in between, so leave room for white. I see what I did. I bled the red over too much. It's okay, we'll fix it right now. I got too excited and I went over too much. You just remove it and, and put white on there. If you want, go put more cream eyeshadow and then put white on top. Remove the red. Try to swipe through and not have to go back and forth because you're just gonna smear. trying to define the line here. Okay, 
and then putting blue down here. Okay, and now just make sure the colors look nice. Like you see here, how it, the red needs to go out more. So go ahead and do that. Drag the red out more to be even. The brow, I'm gonna put vanilla from MAC. You can use the vanilla to blend some of the red on the brow right there. Before we do the, the glitter, go ahead and do fill in your eyebrows a little bit. And don't go over the lines. So if your eyebrows go over the color lines, don't fill it in over the color lines. Just stop right before you start, you hit the red, okay? So I'm grabbing this bluish purple here at the end. And I'm putting it on my finger like that. And I'm also grabbing some of the blue here and I'm kind of scraping it off and I'm going to create like a paste. So I'll put that on the top of my hand plus that and it should be like a blue paste with glitter. Pretty much like that. Okay. That's what I'm putting on top. So put that on top. And if you go outside, it's okay because you're going to blend that anyway. Line the inside of your eye with a white liner, with a white um, eyeliner. And here I'm using NYX again in um, Milk. So now is the fun part. Grab your dual, or grab if you have a glitter adhesive. I'm just putting little dots on to trace the edge there of the blue. When you touch down with the glitter, you have to literally like get the glitter and kiss the, the glue so you're kind of like squashing it and then it becomes like a big gooey mess. So don't put too much of the glue on there. Just grab your, your finger and dip it in the glitter and then you're going to have glitter like that. If you want, shake off some of it so whatever's going to fall out doesn't fall on your face. And then just put it on the little dots. You see? And don't worry if you make a little bit of a mess, like with the glue, because the glue, this glue dries uh, clear. Next. And it looks very festive. Very festive, very cute. All right, now let's, I'm gonna put more mascara on my eyelashes. I'm using a mascara that I bought that I really didn't like, which is Full and Soft Mascara by Maybelline. Because if I get glitter in this, obviously I'm going to ruin it. And since I don't like it, I'll just toss it. Okay, and then my bottom eyelashes, I'm only putting the mascara in the corner, in the, in the outer corner. To my lips, I, what did I do? It's a lip liner, and, I, and it's this Vino from MAC. I put that all over my lips in the bottom. And on top, I put a lip gloss, which is red, and it has gold specks in it, gold glitter specks in it. I bought this in Sephora, and the name erased a very long time ago. I bought this, so I don't even know who makes this. But it's a, there's a number four on the top, if that helps you any. And that is it, guys. I hope you have a lot of fun with this look. Again, it's very patriotic. It's not supposed to be perfect. You know, It's not supposed to be blended and all that complicated stuff we usually do. It's just, you know, fun, patriotic, and of course I have my American red, white, and blue, and I have my, my um, glitter on there symbolizing celebration, rockets, fireworks, and of course I have my peace sign. So I wish you guys an awesome 4th of July. Be safe, and if you do celebrate it, you know, enjoy it. Enjoy your day off if you have Monday off, and um, see you back soon, and... Um, Please do not forget to comment and rate. I appreciate your support. Bye, guys. Have a happy fourth. Bye.